Hello. Today is the day 181 of 365 days project and let's see about the treatment of leukocytosis. Treatment of leukocytosis based on causing antibiotics for infection, treatment of conditions that cause inflammation, antihistamines and inhalers for allergic reactions, chemotherapy, radiation and sometimes a stem cell transplant for leukemia, medication changes if possible, treatment of cause of stress and anxiety if there are present, hyperviscosity syndrome is a medical emergency treated with intravenous fluids, medications and other methods of quickly getting the WBCs counted down. This is done to make the blood less thick as it flows normally again. The best way of prevent leukocytosis to avoid or reduce the risk of the things that cause it. This includes maintaining a healthy lifestyle including a good and hygiene hand washing to avoid infection, staying away from anything that you might cause trigger an allergic reaction, quit smoking to avoid smoking related leukocytosis and lower your risk of cancer, taking medications as directed if there are any being treated for a condition that causes inflammation, trying to lower the amounts of stress in your life and getting related to treated for the serious anxiety or emotional problems. Prognosis In general, leukocytosis is routinely identified in the acute settings phase such as an emergency room or urgent care facility. Quick identification and treatment of driving force for the leukocytosis promotes the resolution of CBC abnormality. Prognosis is therefore and good in these patients. In more severe cases, when there is a driving force of the leukocytosis in an underlying malignancy or myeloproliferative disease, the prognosis depends on the staging. As such, the lymph node, organ system involvement and the genetic profile of the disease process and determines the prognosis. Complications If acute leukocytosis is identified quickly with underlying process treated appropriately, there are few or if any complications occurred, it associated with the treatment rather than the leukocyte elevation. Acute or chronic significant leukosis above 25 into 10 power 9 milliliter, however, can be severe complications and potentially be fatal. WBC counts 25 into 10 power 9 milliliter and above can cause a hyperviscosity type of syndrome. Presenting symptoms of this oncological emergency could include the organ failure and which may lead to death. Here are some important considerable regarding leukocytosis. Prompt identification of leukocytosis should be performed by clinicians obtaining a CBC along with the chart review of our previous CBCs. The elevation of trends. Perform a medication decolligation as many common medications have been linked to non specific leukocytosis. Beware of severe complications related to malignancy associated leukocytosis. Thank you.